quality of presence and an experience of togetherness. It evokes feelings of cosiness, comfort and warmth. Here at The Happy Foodie, we think hugger can be achieved through the food that we eat and the cooking process. I've chosen three cookbooks to share with you today that I think can inspire hugger in your kitchen and beyond. The first cookbook is 26 Grains, a book that actually centres on the idea of hugger itself after author Alex Healy Hutchinson spent some time living in Denmark. Alex realised that there was a connection between hugger and the feeling that she had when she wrapped her hands around a warm bowl of porridge, that the feeling of doing that was just as reviving as eating the dish itself. 26 Grains isn't just about porridge, although the book is full of beautiful recipes, one of my favourite being the blackberry, bay and cacao, but it also has fantastic heartening dinners like this coconut butternut squash curry with black sticky rice and really tempting puddings like this quinoa plum and cardamom frangipan pudding. When you're cooking from 26 grains it's one of those books that restores you in the cooking process as much as it does in the eating and if you're looking for a book that helps you achieve that feeling of hugger whether it be in your morning porridge or a slice of cake at the weekend this is an excellent choice. Next up is a new release from Harry Eastwood. Carnival is a celebration of meat in all of its forms and throughout a collection of really beautiful recipes. But the reason I've chosen this as a cookbook to inspire hugger is that most of these dishes would be excellent as a way of reviving yourself after a long cold walk on an autumn or winter afternoon. The idea of reviving over a portion of Harry's Sunday chicken and tarragon pie sounds quite wonderful and I think the same is true for the ragu bolognese for Rob, Lucky Rob and the Osso Bucco. But along with these reviving recipes that would be perfect to warm you up from the inside out, Carnival also includes a lot of recipes that make me very excited for winter. Those real star recipes that you can tuck into over the colder months and that bring a bit of magic to those dark days. Finally, I've chosen to include this really innovative and creative book on preserving, The Modern Preserver by Kylie Newton. This is an excellent book for anyone that's new to the practice or is old hand because it's full of recipes that put little twists on traditional favourites. I feel The Modern Preserver is perfect for inspiring hugger as around this time of year over the autumn where the harvest is booming, I get the urge to collect as much seasonal produce as possible and preserve it all for those winter months. Plus, if you like to think ahead like me, The Modern Preserver also is packed with ideas for edible gifts, even homemade brown sauce. How impressive would that look? Kylie's flavour combinations are interesting and memorable. Her fennel and orange pickle sounds perfect with everything from sandwiches to cold meats, and the pear and lavender jam sounds irresistibly fragrant. I think this book is a stand-up because of those clever combinations. If you do want to try one of Kylie's recipes, we have a tutorial video for her chocolate raspberry jam, which I can vouch is excellent on toast. So those were our three cookbooks to inspire Hugger. In this video, we're giving away all three, plus the book of Hugger by Louisa Thompson Britz. In this book, you'll be able to find Hugger in the rest of your everyday life and achieve moments of comfort in your routine. To win all three cookbooks, plus the book of Hugger, just leave us a message in the comments below on how you like to achieve hugger in your everyday cooking and eating and remember to subscribe to our channel. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.